What is up everybody, hey Jim Day, welcome back to Way of the Hunter, and today I thought we would do something a little bit different. I figured I'd show y'all, because um, I've seen many wondering, and for a while I myself wondered as well, how to use the callers in this game, because it's a little bit different um, than a lot of other um, games where you just hit a button and it calls. You actually have to do a little bit more work. So, want to get a little bit closer. That's the deer we want to take. Um, I could definitely take him from here. That's not the issue. Um, but just to sort of show y'all how these work, we're going to hop kind of like in this little like tree bush right here. And then we'll go ahead and get out the deer grunt collar, which should be exactly what we need to get these guys just a little bit closer. Um, now most of the times you should be able to take slightly further shots and not have any issues at all But if for whatever reason they're like behind some brush and stuff And you really want to get those animals closer. This is gonna be the way to do that. So what you're gonna do is you're gonna um, You're gonna hold uh, you're gonna hit L2 Okay for PlayStation. So whatever button you hit to zoom and then um, You're gonna hit R2 once it's up and then, um, and then it should, um, make the noise. Okay, so whatever button you shoot with. So whatever button you zoom with, you, to equip the call, basically, and then the shoot button to use it. And originally, um, when you first start off, all this will do is attract does, but once it gets into this white area here, as you can see the little bar on the bottom, um, I might try and zoom in for y'all to see it. Um, once it gets in there, you want to hit it again, and that is going to create the maximum amount of attraction. Okay, so if we look, we should have some deer coming in, and what do you know? We've got some does coming in right here. Two big mature does. We've got another one starting to head this way over here. So. These calls do work. Uh, there's definitely no doubt about that. So if we go on ahead and break out the 308, we want to zoom on in. Zero for 50, because she is a little bit further out. And then go on ahead and take that hard shot right there. Super duper easy to use. Uh, callers are fairly straightforward. Took me just a little while to figure out what buttons to hit, but once you know, it'll work just fine. So here is our dough, and just like that, I mean, perfect heart shot, 308. Usually you can get them to walk straight to you, so you can get that nice easy shot into the heart, and a nice mature white tailed dough, super easy. And I'll go ahead and show y'all. Um, so as you can see, this call right now, if I equipped it, it only attracts females. And that is how all of it will be in the very beginning. But if you go, so I don't know if you can see it in the inventory, but let's go to the encyclopedia. I think I'm trying to remember where, where this stuff was. Give me just a minute, guys. Ah, here we go. So, calling and call levels. You may also lure animals closer to your location if done correctly by a caller corresponding to the animal sample to call a deer. You would use a doe caller to make them think that there's a female nearby. But predators react to the sound of their prey and the sounds of a vulnerable animal. So, once you buy and equip a call, the important thing is to call correctly. Doing otherwise is risky and the animal might recognize you and run away. Each caller has a time period in between calls during which you should not call again because the animal will recognize that there's something wrong. The first call is usually perfect and will lure the animal closer. To make the animals come closer, you have to use it again at the correct time. The correct time is when the caller indicator moves to the middle of a calling time period. So that whiter, thicker strip on the bottom, that is the calling time period. Somewhere in the middle of that, once that little arrow gets to it, that's when you should call again. If you call outside of that, animals might spook. 
So call levels, okay? Based on your experience and a caller type, it might have up to three levels of calling, and this differs for each caller. To unlock higher levels of calling, you need to unlock some perks first. Um, so, and as we can see here, I'm trying to remember which perk it is. Um, here we go. So, these are the calls, all right, right here. Second and third level calls are available after you shoot called animals, okay? And then, so as you can see right now, this only attracts does at the moment. Um, but eventually, you could get it to attract bucks. Um, so lower fitness males, and then also higher fitness males. So you can eventually get it where it'll attract the little guys, and then eventually where it will attract the bigger guys. Okay, so if that makes sense, um, that's kind of how that works. You have to get through those calling levels in order to um, be able to call in bigger and better prey. So, with that said, guys, I hope this was a fairly simple explanation of calling here in Way the Hunter. It's really, really super easy. Doesn't take long. Um, and I definitely recommend doing it a lot so you can get that calling level up and that way you can call in bigger and better animals. So with that said guys, hope you all enjoyed this video, hope you have a wonderful rest of your day, and I will see you next time.